this lesson, we will take a look at three examples of determining what is the best proof method to prove a given statement is true. First, we have for any integer x, if 5x plus 3 is even, then x is odd. It is hard to know what to do with 5x plus 3. However, assuming x is odd or even, we can let x equal 2n if x is even, or x equals 2n plus 1 if x is odd for any integer n. An ideal approach would be to suppose that x is not odd, meaning x is even. Notice that would be equivalent to not q if the original implication is in the form of if p then q. If we can show that 5x plus 3 is not even, meaning odd or not p is true, we have a proof by contrapositive. The form of a proof by contrapositive proves if p then q is true by proving if not q then not p is true. If q then not p is logically equivalent to the original implication. Proof by contrapositive should be used. Next, for any integers x and y, if x is even and y is odd, then x plus y is odd. We know how to represent x and y if they are even and odd. We can let x equal 2m and y equal 2m plus 1 for any integers m and n. We just need to show that x plus y is odd using algebra. The proof will be in the form of if p then q, which is a direct proof. A direct proof should be used. And for the third example, for any integers x and y, x squared minus 4y doesn't equal 2. Notice here we just have a statement p. We don't know much about x and y. However, we can assume the statement is false, meaning we can assume not p, which means there are integers x and y, such that x squared minus 4y equals 2. Then algebraically show we have a contradiction. The tricky part is determining the contradiction. To start, notice x squared is equal to 4y plus 2. There's a common factor of 2 on the right, which gives us x squared equals 2 times the quantity 2y plus 1. From here, notice x squared is a multiple of 2, which indicates x squared is even, and so is x, and so on. This proof takes the form of if not p, then q, where q is false, therefore p, the given statement, is true. Proof by contradiction should be used. I hope you found this helpful.